Hey guys, James here today and welcome to another breakdown video of Movie Stuff Trailer Part 2. This is obviously the uh, the horror one right here. So this is all the horror related objects and themes in The Sims 3 Movie Stuff. So nothing to look at just yet, this is just like a sort of a setup, sort of building up scene. <laughs> That's pretty cool. I, re I, I do really like the look of it anyways. So we'll get a good look at some of the new stuff in just a moment as we get into it. Uh, so right there. I think she's wearing a new top, and possibly- I, I think that hairstyle is the same- I know you can't see it very well, I'm not sure if you see it a bit better later. That hairstyle looks like the same one uh, used in the um, the Western theme as well. Oh, that was a bit awkward. <laughs> I'm doing this in Premiere Pro, so sorry about that. Um, but yeah, that looks like the same hairstyle uh, before, so we know that's probably a new one. And you can see a few objects peeking if we peek through here, but uh, we'll get a better look soon as well. So right here, that guy's wearing a new outfit, which is- really quite odd and somewhat inappropriate as well um and so here we go so yeah new uh, hey we're gonna get back here and have a look at these so we got like that new outfit right there that new sofa uh, in the background as well i believe that's new anyways definitely looks new to me and a new chair in the background a new bookcase i think i i really do apologize because some of these things i say are new and they're not but um that's honestly because i don't memorize everything in the game that guy has a hideous, absolutely hideous monobrow. <laughs> like that. What is going on with that dude there? He's, he's pretty gross. Uh, new outfit there too. A couple of new outfits here as well. Like this bow tie one um, is obviously like a new horror sort of theme going on here. And the stripey arms. You can see all these guys have got new outfits on. If you have a look at them there, they're pretty, pretty well themed. He's also a fairy as well, which is interesting. Um, so yeah, we get, get a look at couple of the outfits here. I'm not a, a style guru, so apologies for not describing the outfits um, themselves. Um, so yeah, this is the second theme. That was the, the first one, the Western theme that we analyzed just before. And we'll have a close look at this one now because we didn't do this before. So right here, obviously, you got the new bookcase and new fireplace in the background and new wall light and that awesome spooky window at the back there with like that cobweb theme to it. And yeah, these, these sofa and chair are definitely new because they're zooming in there. New spooky chairs. I I always like, you always see in horror movies those giant sort of arm chairs with a large back as well. Those are always pretty cool. So it's nice to have that in the game. And that is a new bed. I thought it was, but I, I decided not to say it was a new bed before because I wasn't 100% sure. So you've got the new end table there as well. And a few little decorative items to go on the coffee table. Little, what looks like urns, I guess. And um, I think it's that same hairstyle again that woman's got on. So that's probably one of the key new hairs that comes in the game. And I've obviously got new outfits on. And a very, I don't know what is with the deal with all these inappropriate sort of S&M themed <laughs> outfits going on. But I guess that uh, can be classified as horror. Um, so that's some movie stuff. Uh, not me. That's movie stuff part two right there. We'll have a look at heroes and villains very soon. Check back for that shortly. Anyways, guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.